He has been part of NBC 29 News at 5 for years. And tonight we are sad to report the death of Art Ginsberg, better known as Mr. Food. Ginsberg died this morning after recurrence of pancreatic cancer. He was 81. While no one can take his place, the people at his production company are making plans to continue after a short break. So today, we air his last segment and say goodbye and thanks for all the, oh, it's so good. Carving a turkey can be a real challenge. Well, that is if you're not armed with a few basic tips. And today, our test kitchen team has a few pointers to make anyone a carving pro like Howard. Well, thanks for the compliment. You know, every Thanksgiving, I volunteer and help feed thousands of people who are in need. And we carve hundreds of birds. Well, after doing so many, I came up with a way that's not only easy, it really guarantees the, the juiciest bird, and it doesn't have any of that last minute mess or stress in the kitchen. Okay, after cooking our turkey, we're gonna let it sit and cool for a little bit before carving it. This way, the juices won't run out and we won't burn ourselves. First, we're gonna remove the thigh and the drumsticks. We're gonna gently bend back the drumstick away from the frame and cut between the joint with a knife or kitchen shears. Next, we'll cut along one side of the breastbone, like this, removing half of the breast, all in one piece. It'll look like a, a big boneless roast. After doing the same thing to the other side, we remove the wings and place the cut up turkey in a heavy roasting pan. Pour some chicken broth over it. We're gonna cover it and reheat it right in our oven. Or you know what? Even faster, to free up that much needed oven space, we can steam it right on top of our stovetop. Takes only 15 minutes or so and we'll have the juiciest turkey ever. We can even do this the day before. Either way, right before serving, slice the breast across the grain and it's ready to dish up. Look, the step-by-step -step carving tips are online now, along with a recipe for classic roast turkey as our gift to you. Happy holidays from our kitchen to yours. And may you thankfully enjoy every bit of the... Ooh, it's so good.